I really love bats. I was obsessed since a kid. Unfortunately, in about October, November last year, there was a starvation event that happened and baby flying foxes started coming in and they wouldn't stop. The event came at a time when mothers were either pregnant or breastfeeding. And with a lack of native food due to habitat destruction, they were coming in compromised, underweight, and some barely alive. I soon realized, hey, I can do this. <laughs> so I came in and helped. Most bats are pretty calm and they know that you're going to save them. But unfortunately, nine out of ten rescues I do, they don't survive. So with so many bats and pretty much two carers, I started going out to care for four baby flying foxes. Bobby, Penny, River and Sparkles all had different personalities. Sparkles, she was a bit of a sookie bum. Penny was adorable, she was funny, she'd come up and sniff you and she was a bit cheeky. Bobby was content, as long as he had something in his mouth like the dummy. And then River was pretty cheeky too. Because there was that starvation event and there was not enough carers, I'd have to make these little bottles and warm them up and wrap them up in this little mama roll to mimic their mum's wing holding them. But as they got older, they would start climbing out and venturing out. And when everyone learnt how to fly and forage food, then they will get released. Flying foxes are amazing animals. They are so misunderstood. They play such a vital, important role in our ecosystem. They pollinate during the night and they pollinate long distances. So they pretty much make a new habitat along the way. And I just want to spread the word that we need to be able to coexist with these amazing animals. <laughs>